Roman Reigns refuses to ask for Jey Uso's help during October 11th WWE SmackDown, Roman Reigns wrestled his first match back during Bad Blood 2024, and that was a long time coming for the original Tribal Chief. The event also saw Jimmy Uso return, and then The Rock did the same. Fans in Greenville, South Carolina could not wait to see what was next as they attended the Blue Brands show. This week's SmackDown continued that unfolding drama with Roman Reigns making his presence felt in Greenville. Jimmy Uso opened the show to strong cheers from the crowd, gearing up for a showdown against Solo Sokoa in a classic Big Brother vs. Little Brother match. Roman Reigns soon made his entrance as the original tribal chief, joining the fray and taking control of the moment. With chance of OTC filling the arena, Jimmy handed Reigns the microphone. Roman told the crowd he planned to join him to acknowledge Big Jim, which only fueled the crowd's excitement, leading to loud Uso chants. Reigns made it clear that while he does not understand the brother versus brother rivalry, and he has no wise man, he is the tribal chief, and that means taking what belongs to him. He then reflected on the success they had with the bloodline, but admitted his dissatisfaction with his current position, emphasizing that when they are in the ring, the greatest of all times are here. Jimmy did not hold back, calling Reigns a chief without a tribe and reminding him that he returned at bad blood because Roman needed him. He hinted that they might need help to take down Solo Sokoa and suggested he had someone in mind. The crowd erupted with yeet chants, but Roman dismissed it with a firm, no yeet. Jimmy ended by declaring himself the last family member who still acknowledges Roman Reigns, leaving the ring without further words from the tribal chief. Where do you believe the Bloodline Saga is going next? Please share your thoughts in the comment below.